You want uh, emergency vehicles to get there as quickly as possible and know where to go. Rachel Bramlett Schoenberg says that was her fear when street signs started disappearing from the Darby Point subdivision. We assumed it was kids having a good old time. You know, kids are kids, but we were just more worried about the safety of making sure people were taken care of if there was an emergency, not so much the safety of the neighborhood. You know, I mean, hopefully other kids are looking at this and thinking, nah, I don't think I want to go through that. Surrounded by signs, the Oldham County Police Chief discussed how seriously he's taking this case. But these things have consequences. They're not just games, they're not challenges, they're real life, and people depend upon our service. Without our ability to get there in a timely manner, we can't deliver that service. Since August, investigators say teenagers stole 80 street signs as part of a social media challenge. In some cases, pickup truck was backed up to a street sign at night, and the sign rocked back and forth until uh, the top uh, came off. The teens are accused of then posting pictures online. Police believe 31 teenagers knew what was happening. 18 are now charged with theft by unlawful taking and criminal mischief. You know, most of these kids are not bad kids, but they made a bad mistake, and there's consequences to that mistake. I'm glad it stopped. I'm glad the signs are back up, so if there is an emergency, I'm glad they can get there efficiently and effectively. All the teens are charged in juvenile court, which means we won't learn their individual names. In Buckner, I'm Morgan Lentis, WLKY News.